Um, I'm a sophomore at Temple. Uh, and actually, I found out GCC from my friend, John. Yeah, shout out. Um, I was kind of apprehensive of college ministry just because, like, being submerged into a group of people whom I didn't know was just, like, it was like a scary thought for me. And, you know, like, for us, like, Temple's like a huge school. So I was, like, really nervous and, like, yeah, just like every being here with everybody and like I didn't know anyone like that just kind of scared me so I didn't kind of really enjoy it. Um, but I came to GCC Intro Night last year um, and I was really glad I did and I really glad that I gave GCC a try. Um, the community of GCC is one that honestly cannot be replicated. Uh, they refer to everyone as like brothers and sisters in Christ and like they really they really need it. Um, Kind of like how Christ poured uh, his love onto us, GCC taught me to do the same to my brothers and sisters. Um, the community is literally like one big family, helping each other, encouraging and strengthening each other, each other's walks in Christ. Uh, while there's the whole congregation, there's also family groups. Uh, family groups are just like a smaller group where you can just like, get to know each other on a deeper level and just, yeah, like just encourage each other on a smaller group level. Um, I really like family groups because it really allows us to form deeper connections and just enjoy each other's company. Uh, one family group like happening, I guess you would call it, that really kind of stuck with me ever since like last year was uh, the family group that like my birthday left like fell on, which was like, sounds kind of conceited, but um, <laughs> so like our family group bought me like a cake and Victoria, after our awesome MC, actually made like a homemade card for me. And the, on the card was, uh, I don't know if you guys know, there's a Facebook Messenger basketball game. <laughs> Anybody know it, right? You feel like send a basketball, you like, yeah. So for like two weeks straight, I was obsessed with that game. And I kind of like briefly brought it up in our family group like two weeks prior. I was like, yeah, I'm so obsessed with this game. I love it. And then two weeks later, like I get this card from Victoria. And it had the game on, like a like a picture of the game, and then it was like 19, so like my my age, the age I was turning, and I was just like, I just saw the card, and like it just had a huge impact on me. Like something that I thought was so meaningless, so stupid, that I just kind of blurted out in family group. Like someone listened to it, you know, and that just like that just hit me hard because like there's so many times that you know I feel as myself that I get so consumed in my life and what I'm doing and like my struggles, my stress that like I don't take a moment to look around and see, you know, the people that God has blessed me with and I just don't take a moment to thank them and just seeing that card that Victoria made and just like the love that my family group gave to me, it really just like warmed my heart and just like made me want to think of more. Um, yeah, so being a part of a college Christian, uh, Christian fellowship allowed me to see that um, I think college can be hard for anybody, you know, whether it's because, you know, you want to you wanna fit in or if, you know, you're having difficulty, like, being from home, um, you know, it, it can be hard and, you know, something, a struggle lays underneath that we don't know about. And it's places like this, this Christian fellowship, the people that you can get closer with, that can, like, uh, just help you see that underlying struggle and just you know, care for you and help you get through it. <clears throat> so being a part of a community that only wants the best for you, feels that emptiness of love, that like, underlying problem. And, you know, if you're unsure of a church like I was, like, I still hope that you give GCC a try because there's actually more that needs to I. You know, it's not just the church, it's the family, it's people who uplift you. And, you know, that would just go until the end of time. So, yeah. Thank you, guys.